Shujia! It's your boy, Tim Tim, and his house to bring another great edition of Black Ops 2 for me, because that's what I do on Raid. My favorite camping map. Oh, wait, guess three piece? Guess what? Three piece? Jesus, uh -huh. there! Oh, look, Fist isn't camping. Guess what? He can rush on this map, too! Oh, people think it. Think it just think of people think I can't run. What? Let me show you how to shut down SMG players. Look, I'm on a team full of losers. Look at my score. I'm like guarding this so that my boy can get the flag here. Obviously, we ain't gonna win this game, but that's not the point of this video. The point is a rush down, and I'm gonna show you how to lock down all SMG players. Let me let me put it this way. If you're dealing with SMG players and you're having a problem and you're going solo, even if you have one or two dudes on your team, I'm going to show you the setup to use. Now, this is, you can look at my uh, perks right there. I don't know what they are. I think they're uh, Lightweight and Ghost, Dexterity, and you can mix it up. You can go Tactical Mass or you can go Engineer. You might want to have two setups for the type of people you're dealing with. Either you're going to have a bunch of Claymores and pop-ups, bounce and Betty's, or you're going to have a bunch of shock charges and concussion grenades. Which ones you want to deal with? It's up to you. You know, I was running an axe here trying to be all a little sweet and shit. Didn't work out. I don't think Bravo. I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to run shock charges instead of axes Bravo. because shock charges have much bigger range and uh, even though they don't kill, you really don't need it with the shotgun. Now, I did tweet it out to Vaughn. I was like, the first day you that, that round, but it's I'm a shotgun guy. Step so the up. first day I tested out shotguns, and I was like, yo, Vaughn, shotguns suck, bro. And then the next couple days, I didn't play them. I, I, I mean, to be honest with you, I didn't play them for about a week. And then these patches, hot fixes were coming out, and I, I was ignoring the shotguns, you know, realistically speaking. I didn't think Security Vaughn and those guys objectives. were going to do anything to it. But they put, you know, Securing I got my ass kicked by a team of people that was using shotguns. Enemy took a. Like, let me go ahead and try this out. Maybe they buffed them or something. I was getting worked. So, uh, and I was running SMGs. I'm like, let me go ahead and check it out. So then, I come to find out. Get off me. Uh, uh, brains all over the ground. Then I come to find out. Shotgun's been buffed. I was like, damn, Vaughn got on a black box and fixed one of the shotguns. At least this shotgun is worth using. Worth using. The 870 laser sight long barrel and the four perks that I told you will shut down any SMG rushing team. If you have three players in ground war, shotguns, barrels, lasers, dominate. You want to rush? Drop the SMGs, pick up the shotguns. SMGs have nothing on them. The only thing that can beat. 870 shotgun off the hip, and you won't believe this, is an ADSing sniper. How does an ADS sniper beat a shotgun off the hip with a laser sight? I don't know. I tweeted this to Dan Buddy and David Von Hart. It's ridiculous that a 50 pound uh, sniper rifle can ADS scope in, kill a shotgun player off the hip. You know, that's just ridiculous. You know, you need to slow it down by 500, point 500, hundreds of a tenth millisecond. You have to slow down the ADSing when you get beat by an ADSing uh, sniper rifle shotgun. But, that's the only thing that can, and I predicted this in the beginning. I predicted this when I seen the uh, pregame videos from, you know, they patched everything else but the snipers. Like, they're totally not touching the snipers. And I don't understand the reasoning behind this. I mean, at least at least slow down the ADS for the sniper. There's no way that a shotgun should lose in a close range fight to a sniper up close ADSing and a scope and killing. I mean, that's just ridiculous. So that's the only the, the only problem I have with this game. That's it. With uh, with the exception of bouncing Betty's being thrown 30 feet in front of you and then go off without a detonator. That's another one. That's about, those are the only two things that I have a problem with. They fixed the glitches with the, the uh, networking and matchmaking. So, you know, I wasn't really too shameful of that, but overall, you know, I like the shotgun. 870 uh, long barrel laser takes out any SMG players. I mean, uh, you, it's, it'll take some time before the black box of snipers. It's going to take a while because everybody's going to get onto the sniper bandwagon. Then just you know, be, everybody be pissed off about it, bitching about it. And then finally, it'll get, it'll get black box down the road. But it ain't going to get black box right now. 
So anyways, this got the buff. I highly suggest you get on the shotgun. It's got about a max range with a long barrel. I would say 28 feet to 30. 30 feet, you're talking three shots. Three shots long barrel. About 15 to 12 feet, one shot. So you, it does have range all the way out to 28 feet. Uh, I tested it out. I would say, I, I would say 30 is pushing it. But 28, you get it. Um, other than that, you, any, any SFGs rushing down on you, you won't have a problem. Uh, you just want to make sure you get that laser sight on the face, chest, somewhere in there. And that's my tip for me to you. If you guys want to see my latest combo setups for Thanksgiving weekend, please leave a like. If I get enough likes, I'll break down the combos for you. I'll break down the gameplay. Another thing I want to touch. People don't understand the difference between dead silence and awareness. Let me go ahead and break this down for you. How dead silence and awareness work. Awareness works like this. If you have awareness on, players in this game talk a lot. Uh, player down. Uh, reloading. SMG firing silencer. Uh, picking up this. Doing that. If you have dead silence on, your 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 soldier is not gonna is shut his fat mouth up. You won't be. You know. I mean, it's really simple. Awareness. You can deduce somebody and where they're at by the way they're talking. If you got dead if you if you got dead silence on, they're not gonna be making all. Oh, four piece going out of fury. Press the cop now. Oh my God. Fury. Fury. But um, that's the breakdown of it. You know, if you, if you, if you, you know, once everybody gets really familiar with the map and moving, you know, in an about way, I mean, if you really want to know where somebody's at, just put on uh, awareness. You can hear them talking all day long. If you don't, put on dead silence. It's that simple. I mean, you know, that's the breakdown on it. It's, obviously, it's retarded if you hear footsteps over gunfire, because that'll totally defeat the 10, Pig 10 system and, and the attachments uh, of what the system stands for. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this. I went 51 and 19 with the shotgun. That pretty much solidifies it on a shitty ass team. If you don't get it from there, I don't know what else to tell you. Until next time, Fist. Peace! I'm out!